sir, I'm gonna ask you again to step out of the vehicle. Are you going to comply? Am I being detained, sir? You are being detained. For what? What crime? So here we have a new soft shit who apparently learned all his skills during his jail time. Apparently had a lot of time on his hands in there and learned the ins and outs of dipshittery. Good afternoon, sir. You know why I pulled you over today? You have an invalid inspection. Do you have license registration proof of insurance? Do you have those things? Because if not, we're going to tell your car. I'm not doing commerce right now. What was that? I'm not doing commerce right now. Okay, well, you have, you have two options. You can either provide me that documentation or you can be towed. I'm sorry? You can either provide me your license, registration, proof of insurance, or we'll tow the vehicle. Why do I need insurance for or proof of... So if you're going to hand me that documentation, you can do that. Or we can move on from there. I don't need that if I'm traveling. I can't hear you. Can you speak up, please? I do not need insurance if I'm traveling. I'm not doing... You do. Enough. So you don't need insurance. What the hell was with the voice crack, mate? Right off the bat with the commercial traveling. Uh, so you are, in fact, driving on a public road, meaning you need all the stuff that a police officer requires of you. It is kind of amusing that this is in Pennsylvania, because Pennsylvania versus Mims. <laughs> sure, you tell me you don't have insurance on this vehicle? I did not say that. Okay, do you have your insurance? I don't have... I don't answer no questions. So we're just gonna ignore the double negative. Well, apparently we aren't. But for sake of argument, let's. Damn dumb's always blowing up my witty bit buckets. But yeah, the amusing part is he did answer questions and now he's not answering questions, which is a universal language of he doesn't have any of the stuff he requires. I mean, it is expired after all. Okay. Am I being detained? What was that? Am I being detained? Yes, you're on a traffic stop. You're being detained. For what? County, go ahead to that return. What is the crime? What was that? What is the crime? What is the emergency? You don't have a valid inspection. But all crimes are commercial. Where's the victim? All crimes are commercial. Is that what you just said? Oh, in case you're wondering, uh, the state is the victim in this case. They can be the victim. Not to mention everyone listening to you is also the victim. Can we indict them for that as well? I'm still kind of stuck on the all crime is commercial. What are you even talking about? You utter... Utter dick flute you. Copy. What was that, sir? Okay, go ahead and step out of the vehicle. Am I being detained or am I free to go? You are. Step out of the vehicle. Am I free to go? Sir, I'm not going to ask you again. It is within my right to ask you to step out of the vehicle. And step it's out within of the my right to stay in the car if I'm, I'm not, not being detained. You again. Step out of the vehicle. Am I being detained? What? 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 What do you? What do you think is going on right now? You're in a traffic stop. The officer is asking you to step out of the vehicle. Pennsylvania versus Mims. Rather ironic in Pennsylvania. But if you are being detained during a traffic stop, you're not free to free to go. How? How do you brain? Seven zero eight county. Can you have seven zero two meet me in front of the courthouse? So, fresh out of jail, in front of the courthouse, you decided to drive off with a car that is not registered and actually will ring up. They, they will, con you know, they will look at the cars that drive off. Of fall uh, that is just so dumb. Infuriatingly so. Sir, I'm going to ask you again to step out of the vehicle. Are you going to comply? Am I being detained, sir? You are being detained. For what, what crime? Can Your you cite the penal code? So what is the penal the code? Vehicle. But I don't need a registration because I'm not driving right now. I'm traveling. I can't hear you. You're gonna have to speak up. I said I'm traveling. No, you are driving. You are behind. No, I'm not in commercial. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not in commerce right now. You are in commerce, sir. You need a driver's license and you need a registration. I don't. I'm not doing commerce right now. Okay. Imagine having to deal with dumbs like this. They keep repeating the same thing over and over and over again, and then actually think at some point it's gonna land. Uh, no, th this is just gonna crash into the ocean and drown. Then implode, then explode, and then get launched into space, crashing into the sun. You leave our sun alone. We need that for stuff and things. Mo mostly things. Am I free to go? No, you're going to step out of the vehicle. You are Am detained. I being detained? For what? What's the penal code? What's the penal code? 4703. What is that? Vehicle code. What is that? What? What is that? You're being pulled over because your vehicle is not inspected and that is an infraction of Title 75 of the Pennsylvania Vehicle Code. <laughs> I 
It was at this exact moment he didn't expect that. Well, let me guess, you're gonna ask the question again and again and again, just like you're gonna ask the question of your being detained. Is he being detained? Yes, he is. Am I being detained? Yes, you are. Well, am I being detained though? I mean... <sighs> Oh, he says he's traveling. Orange County, 708. Looks like a city police officer. It's your location. Orange County, I'll be on my TV. 708 County, that's negative at this time. Alright, so here's the deal. You can't move this vehicle from the spot that it's at. If you move this vehicle from the spot that it's at, you'll be pulled over again. You're going to be issued citations through the mail. Sir, what, it, what a charge is? What? What a charge is? A charge is a bill. You are forcing me to receive a bill. You're forcing me into your commerce. Your inspection and your registration's expired. I didn't put that in there. It was already there when you got the car. Correct. So that's that illegal. Has to be maintained to drive on a Pennsylvania road. No, if you're driving, I'm not doing commerce. I'm traveling. I already said a hundred times I'm not doing commerce. You are doing commerce right now. You're forcing me to contract. That's coercion. Coercion? What? Well, first of all, he's not forcing you to do anything. You are actually not doing anything, which is, in this case, the problem. Under normal circumstances, you would have been pulled out of the car, but now you're gonna get some citations, which you're probably gonna fight in court, and then you're gonna get laughed out of court because you're a dick flute. Aid the county, that's negative. Orange County, Okay, you can't move this vehicle. That's the bottom line. You can walk home, and you can park it here, but you can't move this vehicle. Where's the citation? The you can't. What is the citation? He already told you. Hey, hey, go go ahead and ask him if you're being detained. You mother... No, you can't. And I'm not going to argue with you. No, the if citation. You again, you'll be pulled over and you'll be cited again. I said the citation. Where's the citation? Where's the citation? You'll get it in the mail. Because you refuse to provide me your documentation, I can't give it to you right now. Okay, I will receive it. Okay. So, whatever you... But you can't drive. You can't. Travel. I'm not driving. I'm traveling home. I'm not. Tra I'm not driving. So the police have a. They have a gun. Oh, oh, of course, of course, we're gonna do the under the rest. Shut your fucking mouth. The officer didn't even threaten you in any way, shape, or form. But sure, you gotta, you gotta pull your victim card. You do realize this is on the internet. You actually uploaded this shit. How dumb are you? But hey, don't, don't, don't uh, let me stop you from engaging in more dipshittery. Go ahead, speak. He's telling me that I cannot leave this spot. I already told him that I'm not driving, that I'm traveling. He's forcing me to engage in a contract right now. Forcing me. I'm co co coerced. Yeah, pay your bills like a grown-up. You're not special, even though you think you are. And on that reality, Jack, bye-bye. Uh, Imagine coming from jail and then engaging in this. Not a good look, buddy.